To fix a controller that is not turning on, you can try these tips. Connect your PS5 controller to the PS5 USB. If after a few minutes of the controller being connected when you press the PlayStation button, no light appears, you can try to firmly press the PlayStation button. Maybe your button is damaged and needs more force to be pressed. You can also try a different cable. Also make sure that your PS5 is connected to the power outlet. If it's in rest mode, try to charge the controller while the PS5 is turned on. If you think your cable is fine, try connecting the controller to your computer. See if it starts turning on. Also if the controller is severely discharged, it will take some few minutes until the first light appears. If the controller charges when connected to your computer or even when putting the cable into a phone charger, then it may mean that you have turned off the power delivery to your PS5 USBs. To solve that, go to settings, system, power saving, features available in rest mode and turn on supply power in rest mode and put it on always. If nothing until now has worked, you can try resetting the controller. On the back of the controller there is a small hole. Take a SIM ejection tool, a toothpick or a paper clip and press and hold that button. See now if the controller is charging. You can also try to buy a PS5 controller docking station, one that is using these pins instead of the USB Type-C. You can also check if the ports on the controller are dirty or not. Maybe they are dirty and need some cleaning with compressed air or some alcohol. If nothing has worked, your controller might be damaged and need to be taken apart. Also make sure that the controller doesn't look like this, because if you have smashed it, it needs some serious hardware repair. I hope this video helped.